I knew. I knew this was going to happen. I just knew it. I I don't really I don't really know how else to describe this as um, other than absolute absurdity. By the way, if you're new to the channel, as always, I greatly appreciate you getting involved by leaving a like on the video. And if you haven't yet, there's a red subscribe button down below. Greatly, greatly, greatly appreciate you subscribing. Of course, it's free and it helps support the channel. Now, Michael Myers is canceled. People are calling him phobic because two people that were on the wrong end of an interaction with Michael Myers, a fictional psycho in a horror film, happened to be members of the LGBTQ community. And because Michael Myers didn't, I don't know, check their orientation before he dispatched them, he is, and I'm not kidding you, phobic. The third movie is going to be called Halloween Canceled. On screen, uh, uh, evil guy Michael Myers is branded phobic for ending an, a couple that's in the LGBTQ community. Now, first of all, this is one of those like ridiculous arguments. It's the same argument as Dave Chappelle. If you want to be treated as equal, that means you get to get handled by Michael Myers too. If you want to be treated as equal, that means people get to make jokes about your foibles and things like that and things that are unique to you okay that's called equality michael myers has been now branded phobic for dispatching a couple that is in the lgbtq community in the latest installment of the halloween movie the never never dying villain who is well known to be evil incarnate is facing backlash for his choice of victims in the halloween kills film which was released last week i saw this i knew it was going to happen i knew it and now we have it i i don't the, do you think i mean like i would think that this is I, I like ironic satire but it's not this is why i tell people spend less time on twitter i'm not saying to spend less time on the internet but just like, you know, pick and choose your spots. Because I think if you hang out with people this moronic, it's going to rub off on you. It's just going to. While some of the tweets calling out the masked evil guy's perceived prejudice were clearly in jest, they prompted a fierce debate. Michael Myers is phobic. I'm so sad. I can't believe Michael Myers is phobic. I can excuse the ending of other people, but never phobia. Saw that new Halloween movie. Didn't expect Michael Myers to be so phobic. All I got from the new Halloween movie is that Michael Myers is phobic. Sounds crazy, but if Michael Myers were to choose to not... And that couple, it would have sent a strong message to society that we do not accept phobia and probably saves lives in real life. I'm not kidding. In real life. If, if Michael Myers would have said, oh, er, 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 I'm stabbing people, I'm hanging people on, you know, in the closet, I'm, I'm, I'm snapping bones. Oh, wait. You guys enjoy the company of the same gender as you? Go on past. Are you joking? Outraged horror fans pointed out that Michael Myers ends everyone he comes across, with the exception of the young. Michael Myers, and usually these characters do have their lines. Michael Myers has been ending been ending MFers for decades, but him being phobic is where y'all draw the line. One person commented, while well, someone else noted that that he is not he is just human phobic. Others argued that it would be phobic if he didn't end that couple. Equality is Michael Myers also 
ending people in the LGBTQ community and treating them no different than anyone else. The opposite would be phobia. Yeah, what if uh, what if Michael Myers was like, um, ooh, I don't want to, well, I don't want to like, oh, it's a gay couple, oh, I can't, ooh, ooh, yuck. An op-ed written by Amy Hart for the LGBTQ publication Gaming made a similar point, saying that the way he handles the death of that couple in the latest film feels no different than how he ends anyone else. Michael Myers' origin story is a mystery beyond him being a human form of pure evil. He ends people because that's what he does. He is a man of blood and flesh, at least from what we know so far, and the only thing that drives him is suffering and misfortune. In a twisted way, Michael Myers is someone who values most people exactly the same. Zero, right? A number of people were also amused by the backlash and couldn't resist joking that Michael Myers is about to get himself canceled. Michael Myers has made 50 movies and nobody can end this man. Phobia about to finally end his reign of terror, one person tweeted. If Michael Myers doesn't get ahead of this phobia PR nightmare, third movie is going to be called Halloween Cancelled. Now hopefully, a lot of this is a joke, but it doesn't seem like it. It doesn't, it seems like, 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 um, I, I, I wonder, can I ask you guys a question? Have you ever, I don't know if all of you spend time on Twitter or not. I have to, because, you know, I'm researching for topics and interacting with all of you. Um, but when you see these like moronic takes, right? When you see these like takes that are just so insane that no normal person could have said it or written it what do you think like who's who's writing that is it like some zoomer who's like so far up their own rear that they think they're saying something really woke like they, they've drank in so much of the kool-aid that they see it everywhere like oh rainbow that's not complete that you only see half the rainbow that rainbow's phobic because it's talking about separating the lgbtq community or something like that. Like, are these people real? Or are they trolls? Like, I had this dude in my mentions. Like, I used to never block anybody. But if I see you, like, incessantly replying to me with just idiocy, you get blocked. Because I just don't want to see it. And I don't want to see my viewers arguing with idiots all the time. And, like, every couple of days, there's one of these idiots that's, like, purposely... Like, okay, we could talk about the situation with... um with uh kyle here in wisconsin right i made a comment about that on twitter and i got so many people like outright stating very obviously fake false information like so easily researchable and then stating it so emotionally as fact that it made me think like these people are actually insane but then i'm like they have to be trolls right I, I, you ha they have to be trolls. Otherwise, I lose a lot of faith in humanity. I mean, I, I don't even understand. Now, we could talk about the, the Chucky series now, which has always been kind of, um, how do I say, it's been uh, very LGBTQ friendly, or it has like undertones of it, um, which is fine. I, you know, Chucky. I think like the, originally, the the doll thing never really did it for me. I did. I do like me some Jennifer Tilly though, but like I never really cared about the you know the original films were like oh these, you know it's a doll. It was like the eighties horror era was really weird. There, there was like a lot, like Leprechaun, um, you know, Child's Play, um, you know, uh, a lot of people forget, they think the movies are called Chucky, but anyway, those, and then like, you had kind of spoofy con horror films like um, Critters, um, which was actually pretty good, pretty spooky, um, even Gremlins kind of a, a little, I don't know, you, you could probably call that kind of a horror film, right? Um, even Ghostbusters, comedy horror, like that, that crossover was interesting and, and, and I liked them, but I also like movies that are like serious, you know, um, 
I don't think. I mean, there was a petition. There was a petition. Hold on a second. There was a petition. I want to pull it up because I'm almost certain here. There was a petition that because there were firefighters, first responders uh, coming in that, you know, Michael Myers dispatches and 500 people have signed it. Why? Who are these people? It, it's, it's, it's like, it, these are movies. They are not, they are not reality. <sighs> these people need to go touch some grass. I hope you enjoyed this video. We'll talk to you again real soon.